how to add Google AdSense to Hostinger website tutorial. Hello guys and welcome to this new video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can get the uh, Google AdSense uh, ads text and also how you connect your Hostinger website to it. It is going to be a very simple step and also easy process. You're going basically here to have at least an account on Google AdSense. Make sure that you're going to use Google AdSense and not Google Ads because both of these platforms are going to be very different. So make sure that you're going to head over Google AdSense and create a, your account. So basically you're going to head over the sites and you're going to head over here and create your site or new site in here. Basically, as you can see, we have the ad text or ad dot text, and then you're going to have the property set. So I'm going to create this from scratch and we're going to be back in here. So first I'm going to head over uh, hostinger.com. Then we're going to click on websites, websites list. And we are going to have basically the website that we are going to uh, add the Google AdSense to. For example, I'm going to have this one. I'm going to copy the domain or the URL of our domain. And then we are going to click on edit website. Now, what are we going to do is to wait for the editor to open up. We're going to head over to the left side of the screen, click on more settings, integrations, and you are going to see Google AdSense. We're going to click on it. And then as you can see for the content, we are going to have a code like this. So you're going to add the contents of your ad.txt file with the publisher ID in the box below. As you can see here, manage the sellers. It doesn't matter. Now we are going to head over here, add new site. We're going to put the name of the site with the HTTP, HTTPS like that. And then we are going to click on save. Once you have did that, you're going to see that we have the ads.txt snippet. As you can see, we're going to copy it and we are going to have it in here. I'm going to have the code pasted in here. Click on save and update your website. Now we're going to make sure that we are going to verify our website. So basically when you have the changed or the changing live, we're going to have everything in order. So we are going to try and verify the website and see. So let's check it in here real quick. So the site is verified and this is a good sign. So here you can go ahead and request a review and wait for your website in here. So create a constant message. So I'm going to have here the constant message that will appear on the website. And here we have it. Uh, here we have it. We're going to see the uh, ADS or ads.txt status. It is authorized and everything in here is okay. That was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.